Oh, hey, hello. I ain't see you there. It's your boy. Hey, yo, what's up, dorks? Welcome back to my channel. Uh, today, I'm, uh, I'm out of my room, uh, my stinky old room, and uh, we're out in the, in the open, you know? Um, I've been stuck inside my room for 12 days and I can't get out, but here I am. Anyways, guys, today I wanted to, to record something, uh, something new, something interesting. It's not food this time, but I think you guys will like it. It's, uh, these shoes right here. Now, you're probably wondering, uh, Walter, uh, you can't eat shoes. Why are you reviewing shoes? Well, I'll tell you, dude. Um, these shoes are hella dope. <laughs> Uh, these are rip and dips and normally I don't like uh, skating brands or rip and dip like Thrasher and all that kind of stuff But this this looks pretty dope dude. I think you'll be surprised as, as I was uh, Anyways, let's get into it. Actually before I open them up, I actually want to go over the name. The name's kind of weird there. It's uh, Lord Normal UV Activated Slip-Ons Blue and Fuchsia. Fuchsia. I think that's pretty much blue and purple so that doesn't really matter but yeah, they're, they're pretty dope. The only reason why they're dope, however, is because ex once they're exposed to UV light, it should be wild and dude. It changes color. It goes from a white to a blue and red. I've tried them out a couple days ago and they look pretty dope. So let's get into them. All right, so let's get into the box. So the box itself, actually, let me go over the box. The box itself isn't so bad, you know, it's just ripping dip. Uh, blue, blue, uh, it's got this inside right here. And they've been just flipping you off to the sides as well. But uh, let's open it up, shall we? Damn, look at that, homie. So I opened it up. Uh, I bought some few items to heads up, but, but it's going to be a review of mostly the, the shoes. But I got a ripping dip right here, so check that out. Boom. I don't know if you can see that, it's just kind of funny from the distance. But uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. You know? Up next, I got a mask. So this isn't technically part of the, the, the shoe, but I think I believe I got this for free for anything about $100. So that's cool. Uh, the receipt. And then check this out, boys. So the rip of it, little thing that comes with it, it looks pretty dope. Like it's just metal, just chilling out and about with millions of faces. It's pretty, it's pretty cool. And it says it's pretty really cool. But in them, are the shoes. And the shoes, let me tell you, they light up. Look at that, I think literally instantly they just lit up. I think you're seeing it like like real time right now. Look, they were just white when I pulled them out. I don't know if you can see them so great, but look, they just instantly turned blue. That's crazy. Uh, looking at the shoe. Looking at the shoe, we don't have much here, but uh, they're just slip-ons. They're literally just slip-ons, but the great thing about it is that's like, Oh, it just like dope, dude. Like on the side, we got Nerbo right here. Pretty dope. He's flipping you off. Or no, he's not even flipping you off yet. But where he does flip you off is right underneath. Check that out, dude. <laughs> it's pretty funny. Uh, I really don't want to show the bottom because I did wear these a couple days ago. But uh, they look like this. <laughs> you can see the Nerbo right there. It's, it's pretty dope still, though. But uh, it's kind of nasty. <laughs> oh, you can't see it? <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Uh, but it's normal down there with some leaves and some ripping dips, so that's pretty cool. But uh, yeah, dude, these shoes are like wild and um, they just instantly change color as soon as you walk outside. Inside, they'll stay white because they're completely white. But once you step outside, bro, it's like blue and red. It's like hella dope. So in terms of comfortability, these shoes are pretty dope. Uh, I wore them, like I said, I wore them around a couple days already. They look pretty good. They feel pretty good. Uh, I do recommend that you get one one shoe size tall or bigger than yours. My shoe size is 11, so I got these in 12. But uh, I recommend getting it one higher because um, that's what the website says, and they do fit pretty snugly. To put them on, it's not so hard either if you do get them one size bigger because they just slip right in. Uh, my biggest complaint is that they may crease easily. They feel like they crease easily, but that's just a complaint for mostly all new shoes in general. So for this, it's like kind of so-so um to activate they have to be in sunlight um one of my gripes with it however is that the blue isn't as dark as i thought it would be uh it looks way lighter compared to the fuchsia the pink purple violet whatever the frick it is 
but other than that it's pretty pretty cool if you're inside they're, they're just completely white period um it could be a little gray it looks it looks like canvas too as well i don't know if it is canvas i haven't looked into it but the uh, colors just once you step outside the colors just instantly turn into the colors and, and it's dope it's hella cool so there you have it guys just these things are just amazing to look at they're just beautiful normally i'm not a like i said i'm not a big rip and dip kind of guy but when it comes to skater stuff and thrasher and all that i'm not, I'm not a big fan but these shoes are just hella dope dude because they just as soon as you step outside they light up it's it's the little things in life to let you get excited again you know <laughs> it's the little things in life that make you want to live again and this is pretty dope uh in terms of shoes i would probably um let's see for shoes i would give them probably a five out of five just for like how dope they are um i don't know if it is a novelty if if more shoes start doing this it'll become a novelty but for the time being these are five out of five shoes dude i really don't uh well <laughs> these i can't eat it so i'll give it a four out of five <laughs> i'm just kidding but it's five out of five dude anyways uh take care guys and see you later